Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is another Ask Deanna video. I got my second question, so I'm going to go ahead and jump right on in. Do you guys like my hair today? I think I tried to braid out and it actually turned out really good. Let me know in the comments down below if you would like a tutorial on how I got this makeup, I mean makeup look, how I got this hair Okay, look. so this is what her email says. It says, hey Deanna, I have a question for this you. This guy and I have been talking for over two years now and everything has been great. The only problem is that now he wants to add a title to our relationship and I'm not sure if I'm ready to do that. I say that because he is a really amazing guy, but all his past relationships, he has cheated on his girlfriend. He tells me that I'm different. He has, he is a changed person, but I'm not sure if I believe him. Do you have any advice for this me? This question is something that is really hard for me to answer because people, because I don't personally know him. So it's going to be a little bit all over the place and I apologize in advance. So first and foremost, um... From the situation that you explained to me, it kind of seems like you guys are pretty much already dating just without a title. Um, and most of the time, um, guys, just like given how guys are, aren't usually the types of people who, when they're in a situation like that, ask for a title. Usually it's the other way around. You know what I mean? So already with him, after two years of kind of dealing with you and, and, um, you guys have been going through all these great things and for him to want a relationship kind of seems like just in my opinion it's not set in stone or anything that maybe he has changed a little bit because he's seeking for a commitment um sometimes guys cheat because they just for whatever reason commitment is just not their thing they're not good at commitment so if he's a cheater right and you guys are already together, you guys spend all this time together and do pretty much everything that someone in a relationship would do, um, he really wouldn't have a desire to add that title if he still wanted to cheat. If that he makes really sense. does want to um, be committed to you because for, I can't think of any other reason as to why he would try to add a title just to later on go ahead and cheat. Um, for me, it's hard because, you know, when I, I think when I was younger, like when I was first getting into relationships, I always felt like if you cheated on them, you would cheat on me. And as I got, as I've gotten older and more mature and my outlook on relationships have changed, I do believe that people can and do change. Um, I just don't know. So when. my advice to you is if you want to be in a relationship with him and the only reason as to why you are not in a relationship is because of his past um, you know, you guys have been dealing with each other for two years and you obviously, I'm sure both really care about each other. You know, life is short and you don't really find, um, relationships all the time where you really just like that person. I would say go for it. At this point in time, you should trust him. You guys should have a friendship. You should have a pretty decent relationship, you know, so you, 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 you can kind of fill out and you should kind of know, like, you know, what it is and, and how he's going to act. You know what I'm saying? Don't let his past define y'all you guys as present because I have made a lot of different um, mistakes in my life and in my, my friendships in my relationships and if I meet a new person or I'm put in a new situation and I've really grown as a person I don't want to be held back by something I did back then you know what I'm saying give him the benefit of the doubt that he has changed um and he has grown and try it out you know what I mean I it can't, I don't want to say it can't hurt because it can hurt um, if the same thing does happen. But you never know unless you try. And I'm just such a firm believer. And just don't let things stop you because you want, let me tell you something. You want to be with him, which is why you're questioning it. Because you know you want to, you're just afraid, you know. And don't let things hold you back. Life is short. If he makes you happy enough to be dealing with him for two years and you're not in a relationship with him, he makes you happy. So go for it. You know what I mean? I wish you guys nothing but the best. Um, if I forgot to mention anything or if any of you guys have any advice for her, please leave them down in the comments down below. And if you guys have any questions, please email me. Um, I love doing this Ask Deanna series. It's so much fun just like hearing from you guys and being able to really help you. Um, so yeah, please send in your questions. They don't have to be relationship um, questions. Um, the first two that I did were relationship questions. They can be any type of question, hair, makeup, they can be um, like any type of lifestyle questions, career, college related. I am a college student. 
Um, you know, they can be friendship relate related, family related, whatever the case may be. Like, I don't care. So anyways, that is all for this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below to help her out and let me know what you guys want to see next. And as always, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.